finally got to go see Leave No Trace. This is a film that probably not a whole lot of people know about. Um, they talk about it a lot on a lot of the YouTube shows I watch on Collider. Um, and I just had heard really good things about the film. And it stars Ben Foster and this girl named Thomasin McKenzie. Um, it's a father-daughter movie. He is a war veteran. Um, he's suffering from PTSD. Uh, and and um, they he just really cannot be a part of society. He doesn't like to be around people. Um, so they are living out in the woods at the beginning of this movie. Um, just kind of camping, basically. <laughs> um, and it's just an interesting movie right from the get-go to see how these people are living out in the woods. Um, then they kind of get caught and they kind of get try to be forced back into the system and Ben Foster doesn't really want to do it uh the daughter does and then it's kind of about their story um and then some other stuff happens I I really enjoyed especially the beginning of this movie it really it really grabs you and it gets you invested in the story really quickly I love the performances by both of the uh, the girl and Ben Foster in this movie. They're both fantastic. They have really good chemistry. And um, you can tell, you know, he really loves his daughter, but he's got a lot of issues and he just wants, uh, he just can't be a part of uh, society. He just wants to live out in the woods and be left alone. Um, it's a really interesting story. Now, I will say um, this is definitely a slow burn kind of movie. Um, and the story kind of goes somewhere that I wasn't really expecting, and then it kind of just ends. Um, so I just think they could have done something a little bit different. I don't know if this is based on a true story or not, but um, I don't know how I feel about the ending so much, and really the second half of the movie, um, because you're start, you start to be like, okay, what's going on here? Um, is there kind of a point to this movie? And then it kind of just ends. But... I enjoyed the performances enough and I kind of like the whole survivalist element of the film where they're just out there trying to survive and the performances were fantastic and there is some really cool shots um, and I don't know I just I just really enjoyed the movie I'm not gonna say it's like the greatest thing ever or anything but um, this might have cracked uh, my top 20 if I had not already done it before this list um, but since I already done my list it's not gonna make it there I'm going to give Leave No Trace a 4 out of 5. It's quite good. If you like Ben Foster, if you want to see some really good performances about two people trying to survive out in the woods, um, definitely check it out. Until next time, this is Rainy Cage. Peace out.